the organization and his approach to managing this team week in and week out. And just that picture you see as an armband on with an American flag as its salute to the Heroes Night. You know, that's the kind of leader he is. I feel like his presence as a player turned coach has really been big for this Steel squad. Underway from Bethlehem. Brought on back in January. And he has answered the call 35 saves so far in his young Red Bulls to career. Now Bethlehem going to work. This is Santi Moore. Moore will take the shot. And the first blast of the game goes just a bit high. Kept alive by Bezicourt. Bezicourt gets one away, and it puts McGuire on the move. He was able to get a hand on it just before it was headed towards the post. And that's that little. Bethlehem creating an opportunity here. Nako will take the shot, hit the crossbar, and it comes back out. Derek Etienne tried to squeeze one inside. Senti Moore winds up with it for Bethlehem. Again, it's Nanko trying to beat the defense. He has got time and space and numbers. The nice one, too. Nanko squirting free, and it's the first goal of the match for Bethlehem. Nanko already has been so dangerous. We told you that this was going to be an opportunity for him to shine, and shine he has. Vasiljevic. Gets a touch. That's a nice pass and threading the needle. Bezicourt shaking free and a great save by McGuire. This ball serviced in. And the steal now will track it down. Santi Moore one on one. Moore gets by one defender. Clear path, the cross, and the goal. That's Fabian Herbers going top shelf, and it's 2-0. Next, very confident, and the dynamic combination. Herbers finishes it off, and it's a two-goal lead. Yellow card, first of the match, is going to be issued here, and it goes to Herbers, who just scored the goal. Which is without a loss, that's pretty impressive. Yeah, that's good in whatever you know, however your team is, how, has been, however long that you have been there, or whatever league you play in, as we see a pretty tough tackle there on Chambers. And it's going to draw a yellow, and Etienne cannot believe it. Not allowing that that outlet pass, the the lane, to be clear into Allen, but Allen is getting the ball deeper than he likes to get it. Etienne. Goes back the other way. Tremendous pass. And how about another one-handed glove on it by McGuire. He is red hot in net for Bethlehem. All right, that's a good foul by Etienne. Bezicourt with the surface. The ball gets loose. And let's see, collision with the goalie. As Nadam was all over it, ran right into no, to McGuire. And I don't think... Here's the look at the play one more time. A clear collision in midair. And that's, oh gosh, that's a hard call for me because if that's any other player and not the goalkeeper, that's not a foul, right? They both went up for the ball and McGuire just lets go of it. <laughs> that's a tough call to, to go against Nadam. He does a really good job of just challenging for the ball. So officially no goal. Very, very close call but if anything that certainly rattles the cage that's the way they're attacking back and forth between this what they just did to earn the corner kick is a direct kick a direct ball behind the back line and then something where they build up here's the service on the header and it's just a little bit high great idea though the crowd appreciates the effort New York crashing on that far side as Lewis came flying in and look at the contact just outside the 18 this is going to be a yellow card for sure as Nanko. Oh, looks like took a shot to the face. Tim Schmoll goes down. And that is 
that's certainly the one that he is going to feel. And looks like we have a little skirmish now on the far side. But Samuel, when he was sliding through, hitting a jam on the face, square in the nose. No, thank you. Don't miss that. Samuel gives the gem. Pat on the back after that one, but the gem clearly shaken up. A yellow card has been assessed to New York Red Bulls, number 17, Arun Basiljevic. Yellow card assessed to the 76 minutes. So Basiljevic issued the yellow card for New York. Not a good sequence for Red Bulls, too. They get issued a yellow card, and one of their top players, Najem, still trying to shake the cobwebs. Now New York with the attack. Red Bulls, too, have been looking for this for a long time. Again, McGuire tested. He came out, got a foot on it, and he bails his team out once again. The steel just out tactically played the Rebels, too. How about Jake McGuire? He's played 12 games now. He's got five shutouts. One of the hottest goalies in the league. So Bethlehem gets the 2-0 result. We'll wrap this one up from Goodman Stadium when we return.